what's up guys welcome back to my channel you guys know it's me Jerry you watching where's garage and this video is gonna be on what mods that I put on my car I have a few people that messaged me asked me what did I do to the car and everything's on the video on the YouTube but I'll make a video showing you guys what I put on it what mods I got and yeah just gonna show you guys what mods I got in my car so yeah I'm gonna show you guys that uh, like, sorry for my car, it's kind of dirty right now. I haven't been driving it for, uh, I'd say about almost a week. It's been parked, but it's dirty right now, but I don't mind that right now, but let's get to the video. Let's get going. Let's go. All right. First mod that I got for my car was an asset support from Cobb. You want to get this before you want to do any mods on your mods of speed, but this is one of my mods that I got, um, that I got for my car. As you guys see, I got the cob knob, but like two weeks ago, got that. Posted a video on that of me putting that on. Short, short video, but you guys see, it's in the video. But those are the mods that I got from the inside. I have a little mount. It comes with a little mount from Asset Support. Uh, my car is tuned on E85 from Frink Tune. Um, good tune. Love the tune. It's you. You know a big old difference. Once, once you get your car tuned from Freak Tune to go on E85, but that's what I got from the from the inside of the car. I only just got these two things: uh, the access port and the cob knob. Right, let's go from outside. Uh, next mod I got out on my car is or got on my car is the uh, Cosmic Racing rims. Again, my car is dirty. Sorry, but I haven't drove it for almost a week. But I got the Cos Cosmic Racing rims, Hyper Bronze. I got. Um, the rim size is um, uh, 18 by 9 plus 33. Um, that's the size I got on my car. The size of the tires. It's all the way around the front and rear. 225, 45, ZR18s. Um, let's see, I'll show you the guys in the back. Those. That's one of the mods I got on my car. The next one was I got the uh, Rally Armor mud flaps. I don't have a video of me putting those on, but I have mud flaps on my Mazda Speed. What do they look like? I got the um, black and red match with the car, but you can get different colors. Um, next mod I got up on my car are Stop Tech uh, slotted rotors. I got the slotted rotors front and back, um, stainless steel brake lines front and back, and the pads front and back. That's one of the mods I got in my car. The next ones, or you can't see them, but I got D2 coilovers. It's not focusing. Uh, there it goes, D2 coilovers. Uh, I got that for my Mazda Speed. If you can see on the side, has the, the uh, massive um, adjustable end links. I got that for my car. But, yeah, but those are the mods I put on my car. Next mod, I got the Project Motorsports um, wing extension. Looks nice. Like I said, my car is dirty right now, so it's, it's a little bit dirty. It shows on the video, but yeah, I washed my car in a cool minute. But yeah, got that. That's the wing extension I got for the next. The uh, other mod I got on my car, and I got the some this. Antenna, it's a carbon fiber antenna. I forgot where I got it off from, but I got it off from uh, eBay. But um, I forgot the name where I got it from. But I got it on eBay. I just got it because it was carbon fiber. And it says Mazda Speed on there. I think this was black at first, but then you know the sun and it made it gold. But it kind of come out came out pretty good because it matched with the rims. <laughs> but yeah, got that. I got the carbon fiber. I got the carbon fiber raised hood scoop from Court Sport. That's what it looks. Again, it's just a little bit dirty because I haven't washed my car, but that's it. That's this one, that's my mod that I got in my car. Mod speed. I'm gonna make a video of me taking this off and uh, I'm gonna sand this down and paint it black, make it look brand new again. It's kind of you can see it's faded. A little bit, but no, not a little bit. So it faded a lot actually. But that was one of the mods. next mod. I got the 
Cobb um, front mount intercooler kit. Got that. So here's the front mount right here. That's the mod that I put on my car. Next mod I have the Cobb SF intake system. I got that with the wrinkle black air box. Um, air box came with, it was this air box with this. Get the Cobb, you can't see it. Little filter right there. That, next mod. Got the Quartz Sport um, bypass valve. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get the um, the Cobb bypass valve. Just haven't got to it yet, but I'm gonna get that soon. I have the full Cobb turbo inlet. Go, go all the way back. Can see, but see, Cobb goes to the turbo. Uh, I got the full Cobb uh, intake. Um, yeah, uh, I have, you can't see it, but it came with the front mount kit, but I have the weight, the cob weight, just comes with the intercooler kit uh, for your shifter. You put a little weight on your shifter right there. I have that. What else? What else? What else? Uh, I missed something. Uh, I think that's it. The mods for the engine. Oh, I have, um, Top or Quartz Sport um, high pressure fill pump. Got that from Quartz Sport. I have Quartz Sport. Can't see it. Let's see. Let's see. Nah, you can't see it, but I have the Quartz Sport uh, transmission mount. Um, yeah, I do also have the Cobb um, rear motor mount. I have that. The only thing I need to get is I'm going to get the Quartz Sport uh, passenger side. I haven't got to that yet, but I am getting that soon. I have the Cobb. This is downpipe. Let's see if you can see. Can't see, but you see the cob. I uh, got the uh, cob SS downpipe with the high flow cat on it. I have that. It's one of the mods I got. I think that's it. The motor. Um, yeah. And I said I have hello horns. It's not on yet. I didn't put it on the car yet. But I have hello horns on the car. Well, not on the car, but I have it. I just haven't put it on the car yet. But I have that. But yeah, those are the mods that I, I have in my car. Um, and you guys can see I have mostly cop stuff because I love their products. People will say they're good products, but it just overpriced. But hey, I still bought it. Got it. <laughs> but yeah, I got that. Those are mine. I'm still gonna do a lot more. I'm gonna get the Cobb um, SS exhaust to match with the downpipe. I'm gonna get that soon. I wanna get um, the Quartz Sport um, steering wheel. We'll get that soon. So I'm planning on getting that. Um, I'm planning, planning on getting a lot of stuff, just haven't got to it yet. I wanna find a valve cover like an extra one because I want to send it up and paint it. I want to paint it wrinkled black uh, to match with the piping and the air box. But what do you guys think? I'm thinking either wrinkled black or wrinkled red. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below what color valve cover you think I should do. Wrinkled black or wrinkled red? Uh, yeah, I still have the stock oil cap. I'm going to get the red one. I'm, I'm just been lagging on that <laughs> um, but yeah uh, I'm planning on doing a lot more other stuff on this car I want to I got a new battery just like I said the car is kind of dirty and stuff but I got a new battery uh, like two months ago I want to I want to sand this down get all this this rust stuff down and I want to sand down and paint it uh, black and make it look new again I'm going to get the quartz sport battery box too I just haven't got that yet but I'm going to get that because like I said I want to make my engine bay look nice it looks dirty right now, but trust me, it's gonna be looking. It look, it will look clean later on. But yeah, but like I said, let me know about the valve cover. Wrinkle black or wrinkle red? I was thinking about getting. Um, I looked. I wanted to get JF uh, J, the JMF intake, but then I heard from a few people that the intake not really good. Uh, they either 
go with the, uh, the I guess the Focus ST intake manifold with the what kit was it from? I think it was from Damien. Damien, uh, I think his site sells the Focus ST intake. Uh, I'm not sure. I gotta look it up and see. But I'll either it's either that with the uh, pour injection. So I might go that end up going that route because. I was gonna go with the J JM the JF JMF intake manifold, but what you guys think that should go what intake that focus ST or the JMF? Let me know in the comments what you guys think I should do. Um but yeah, this is my mods on my car. I did Yeah, and that's my mod list for my Mazda Speed. Um, yeah, let me guys, let, guys, let me know what I should do next. Uh, I say, let me know what the the valve cover, uh, wrinkle red or wrinkle black. Probably wrinkle red, and so it won't be too much wrinkle black on it. But yeah, let me let me let me know what you guys think. What I should do with that? But yeah, that's my mods list for my Mazda Speed. Uh, that's that. That's what I did on my car. But yeah, just let me guys let me know what you guys think about this video i hope you guys liked it um like i said i got a video on coming for the hello horns and i got other stuff coming but just like i said as you guys know it's just been busy and i've been quarantined i'm better now i just got the call that i'm good now so i don't have the virus no more but that's why the car been sitting sitting i've been right now just been quarantined um but yeah you guys let me know what I should do next to the car. Thanks for watching. My name is Jerry, you know. Uh, and thanks for watching Where's Garage. See you later.